Now that the coaches have seen this year's problem set, we asked them which questions play to their team's strengths. I think they could do all of them given enough time. Uh, we have really uh, one guy who's really strong in geometry. Um, another guy is really strong in graph algorithms. Um, another guy is really strong in um, dynamic programming type problems. So they cover the whole the whole gamut of things. Um, well, they they are they are usually somewhat good at uh, problems with uh, short codes, but some uh, uh, math idea that you have to realize. And today they has sort of a tough start because they they had difficulties with a few problems, and, and now they're. Right now, I, I was watching them, and they are working on a geometry problem, which they usually do quite fine, but this one is somewhat trickier. They're a fairly graph theory heavy team, um, so problem C, uh, they haven't done yet. I hope that they'll get it in the last hour. Uh, J, same thing. Um, they are not a, a number theory heavy team, but they have uh, just started putting in runs for D in the last hour, so we'll see how that turns out. <laughs> First of all, I like these problems. They're really good, but not for my pro not for my team. Uh, they f cannot solve one problem, and I'm very upset about it. Their their knowledge is kind of all over the place on things. Um, I think that in many ways it depends on the luck of the draw it's of what the the problem setters. Um, have focused on in terms of their problems, but uh, when I was looking through the problem set, I thought, hey, these are some tractable problems. So I was happy. For all the latest updates on the 2013 World Finals in St. Petersburg, follow us on icpcnews.com.